Peace. Jamila, I'm set here. It's been a long time since I made a video or whatever. So I wanted to just come around and do a, uh, it's been a year and a half check-in. It's um, been a year and a half. So that means 18 months. My locks are 18 months officially. And um, I started my lock adventure January 2019. Did I start January 2019? Was it literally just last year? It feels like it's been so much longer. <sighs> January 2019, I started my locks. And this is the month of June. This is June 2020. And so I've been locked for 18 months. And um, I started with a whole bunch of stuff, child. I started with, I think it was like braids. And then it wasn't locking, so I took out my braids. I, the video show it all. It was just a lot going on. And um, over the past six months, I hadn't really done a whole lot to my hair. Uh, the first year was a, like really rough in terms of locking it. It took a while for it to lock. But over the past six months, it, you know, it's been coming along nicely. So I'm not going to keep y'all waiting and anticipating and all that stuff on my hair. These are my lock babies. So I dyed it, I think, last week. Last week I dyed it. So right now it's a little dry. But let's take my hair. I'm going to show you the back. Wait, no, nope, I'm all the way off the screen. Just look. Okay, and then this is the other side. So as a regular practice, I don't put shit in my hair, except for water. Um, there are a lot of times where I put coconut oil, um, but I haven't done so in a very long time. Now that I've colored my hair, I know I'm going to have to start moisturizing it a lot more. So I plan on getting some aloe, I plan on getting some um, actual moisturizer. I have been very anti-product for about a year and a half and um, recently when I decided to go ahead and just color it I was like okay you know now I gotta figure out what products will work really well for my hair um, as you can see like my locks almost have two different swag so on this side these locks are a lot thicker and a lot more juicy you know they're all beautiful but these are definitely very let freedom ring on this side. and on this side they're a lot smaller more petite um, some of them are actually clicking up so if you can see this one this one is growing together so this will be one lock I know they call it like two-headed dragon so this is a lot slimmer so this is just by itself this one right here is my very special bang lock and even this right here I combined these together so these are four four locks combined together one two three four um yeah so there are some combinations here this one is another one um when it comes to maintenance I don't retwist it I don't do any retwisting. So these are free to be, free to relock, free to do whatever it is that they do. Um, and uh, I will say that I'm glad now that I did lock my hair 
as you can see like the even the the blonde so the blonde tips i don't know if you remember my previous videos but there were blonde tips already on my previous video i mean on my hair before so the color just colored all of this and just colored the the rest of the hair not like the tips so the tips are still blonde and i don't know if they'll ever not be blonde anymore I have been having the same blonde tips since my hair, since even before my hair was locked. So it just kind of feels like, oh, okay, this is what my hair is doing great. And um, I love my hair. I, I love the, I love this color. Like, <coughs> I just feel like this color, like, look, it just be matching. Like, I feel like a ginger. I feel like a redhead. I feel like it's all just red, reddish brown, just beautiful. It's just Caribbean and beautiful, you know, so... No, thank you. So it's um it's it's beautiful to see my hair transitioning and blooming in this process. But um but yeah, so that's about it. You know, my hair is doing well. And um if you have any tips about keeping your hair moisturized while locked, I would love to hear tips. I would love to um to know, you know, how to make sure that it's not getting brittle and you know all that stuff and um that's about it so thanks for tuning in